Hey guys, welcome to my Q&A. Today I'm going to be answering some questions that I got from you guys on Instagram uh, yesterday or the day before. And yeah, just kind of going through those. I combined some of them because a lot of them were similar. And so I figured I might as well just combine them. So, eee. so let's see. The first question is, what inspires you to write songs and what's your base inspiration when writing a song? I think it depends a lot on what I'm trying to write about specifically. I draw a lot from my own life and experiences and all that. So I draw a lot from just my experience and trying to put a feeling or idea or concept into words in the most poetic way possible. <laughs> I get a lot of inspiration from listening to other music. That definitely gives me ideas. Listening to my favorite artists and such. I find a lot of inspiration more recently, I think, from scripture and just, I don't know, themes or things that apply to me in my life where I am right now. So that's kind of where I draw inspiration from. Question number two, how long does it take to write a song? How do the lyrics of a song come to you and how do you put them in a song? Well, I'll answer the first part first. How long does it take me to write a song? It completely depends. It could take me an hour. It could take me a few months. It's, it's not really, I haven't gotten it down to kind of a science yet. It's just kind of, if I, if the words come, they come. And if they don't, they don't, but yeah. So it, it just really depends. And the second part, how long, how do the lyrics of a song come to you? That kind of goes with the inspiration thing. Um, I just try, I sit there and I picture what I want to say in this song. I picture what I'm trying to communicate and I find the best way to put that into words. And I think of what do I want it to sound like? What would give the best what would help the message to come across the best. If it's guitar, if it's piano, if it's a ballad, if it's more upbeat, if it's, I don't know, just trying to figure out the best way to communicate what I want to say. Um, so that's kind of how they come to me, I guess. A lot of the times it's, I think of a line that sounds good and try to find something that sounds good with that line that also makes sense and it just kind of go from there. Sometimes I'll think of a line with another line that makes completely no sense but it sounds cool and I'm like, well I might as well just put that in there for now and then I go back and change it later if I want to. Or I find some way to make that line mean something. Again, it just really depends on the song. Okay. Number three, when did you start writing songs? What was your first musical instrument you started playing and when? And when did you when did you start your interest in music? Well, I've been writing songs since I was two. I have videos of me walking around my living room when I was a toddler singing songs that I wrote. The first song I ever wrote was called Ragaroo. I had one called Hooray for Strawberries. I had, I don't even know, there were so many, but, so I've been writing songs for basically as long as I could talk. And same with music, I, before I even knew how to play instruments, uh, my parents got me and my brother some little drums or a guitar or a mini keyboard or whatever, and we would just play them even though we didn't know how to play, but we thought it sounded good, and we would sing my songs. My brother and I had a band, actually, called The Howlers, and we had, like, stage names and everything, and we were going to get my sister to join when she was older, but that never happened, so the band kind of broke up. But, <laughs> but that's okay. But yeah, I've been playing music for as long as I can remember. And in terms of the first instrument that I started playing, I started taking piano when I was seven, and I've been playing ever since then, so a long time. And then I started playing guitar, I don't know, not seriously until recently. Um, I just kind of knew a few chords and would play around, but 
and ukulele, kind of same thing. I just kind of play it whenever, but piano is like my main instrument that I know how to play. Question number four, what is my favorite thing about writing songs? My favorite thing about writing songs is when someone comes up to me and says, I was going through this thing, but your song really helped me to get through that. Or if I get an email or a text or just anything where I can see kind of the fruit of what I'm doing paying off. And that's the best part because that's why I write music is I write music to be able to affect people and help people. And music is such a therapeutic thing for me and being able to create that for someone else is the reason that I make music. Question number five. What type of music or musician inspires you? What and who's your favorite band or singer right now? Um, what type of music inspires me? Music that has something to say. Lyrics are what inspire me. The music, the accompaniment and everything that can inspire me, but it's normally the lyrics. And I, I want to understand what the singer is trying to say, whether it's about love or God or depression or a strong emotion or strong message or something that I can relate to and connect to and understand. That's what um, type of music inspires me the most. In terms of my favorite band or singer, my all-time favorite singer is Vance Joy. Okay, okay, I met him. He's really nice. I told him I loved him. Not my best moment, but, <laughs> but so he's definitely my favorite, all-time favorite singer. I don't know if he is currently, just I don't, I haven't listened to him as much lately. I just listen to a lot of playlists, so I'm not really sure. And I mean, 21 Pilots is my all-time favorite band, but I'm not sure, again, if currently I would say that, but I don't know. I like a lot of music. I, I'll listen to basically anything. But yeah, again, it's mostly 21 Pilots and Vance Joy who are just like, when I think of my favorites, that's what comes to mind. Question number six. Do any of your songs have a Christian meaning or themes, or have you ever thought about doing that? Yes, they do. Not so much on my first EP, but on Golden Hour, Lifeboat and Safe are 100%. Like. Yeah, those two are literally about God. And the rest of them, I mean, every now and then I'll drop a little thing in there that, you know, if you're listening closely, you might catch it. That's, that's kind, of, kind of a hinting towards some Christian theme or whatever. But, so yes, absolutely. And I plan to do more of that in the future. Okay, question number seven. Most of your videos, I would assume my covers, um, this person means, seem quiet slash soft. Have you ever considered rock or rap songs? That's a hard question because absolutely, but at the same time, if I did do those kind of songs, I would probably make them more quiet or soft just because I'm either gonna be playing keyboard or guitar or ukulele and it's hard to do acoustic guitar, piano, acoustic guitar, or ukulele. So it's hard to do like hard rock songs with just one of those instruments or even rap. So potentially rock, I could definitely turn into some kind of ballad, I don't know. <laughs> um, I'm just trying to kind of work with the resources that I have. So I would love to be able to do more of that kind of stuff, but at this point I'm not sure how successful I would be at actually accomplishing that. But that comes to the end of our questions. Thank you so much for watching, and if you have any more, um, drop them in the comments or find me on Instagram and ask me. And also I'd love to be able to answer some more questions that you guys had. Um, so. If we get to 25 likes on this video, then I will make a part two. So, it's up to you guys now. 
But thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified whenever I post a video. My social media links are in the description box down below, as usual. So, hey, thanks guys. Also, me and me are making a video together next week, so go to subscribe to my channel! I'm not putting that in there. I'm talking about, like, real talk. I'm not just talking. Mm. Who is your crush in fifth grade? Who's the best? No, what? you're the best. Th you're the best. Thank you. Who's the best? Me. Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and uh, I have one more question that I forgot about. And it's, um, do you like reggae? And my answer would be... Yas, man! <laughs>